Hello everyone, welcome to Rybrook Land Rover in Uddersfield. Today we've got a Bentley Continental G GTC 6 litre petrol convertible in black. It was registered in June of 2008. MOT expires on the 3rd of May 2017. So taking a closer look at the car. Basically you've just got your age related stone chips knocking about on the front there. We'll have a good look at the bottom of the grille. No issues at all, really clean. Checking on the bonnet, no dinks or anything. Windscreen's in excellent order. Uh, just panning over this front arch here, it's pretty clean. However, you've got a couple of light scratches knocking about there and you've got a slight little bubble and bubble in there and a little crack appearing there. Looking on this alloy, it's got some slight curb damage. Just running up on the edge there, a slight scuff mark there. And you've got five mil of tread on that one. Panning down the um, near side, nice and straight. Windows are in excellent order. Mirror house has got a light sc scuff on it there. Hopefully that should buff out. Door edge is fine. Looking down on the bottom of the sill, just some light scratches knocking about there. Door edge is fine again. And um, this panel is really clean. Panning over this rear arch here, all good. Just got a couple of light scratches knocking about there. Uh, this alloy has got some slight curb damage there, as you can see. And um, so I do apologize for the dirt on the alloy. And that's about it. And you've got four and a half mil on that one. So panning across to the rear, um, tail lights are in excellent order. Scanning down on the rear bumper, you've just got some light scratches knocking about. A couple of marks here and there. And that's about it, to be fair. As you can see, you've got some light scratches. None of these are deep, they're pretty light. So, panning over this arch here, again, clean arch. Just got some light scratches knocking about there. Uh, this alloy, again, has got some slight curb damage to it, just appearing there, as you can see. And you've got four and a half mil on that one as well. Panning on the offside, looking for any dinks or anything, nice and straight. Windows are all good also. Door edge might require a, a few touchings there as you can see um, scanning down on the bottom sill really clean but you just got some light scratches just underneath there door edge is fine mirror housing is fine scanning over this front arch here all good just a couple one or two light scratches and that's about it um, again it's cleaner alloy but you have got some uh, paint peeling in various places and slight, uh, you've got a slight nick there and you've got 5mm on that one as well. So that's it for the exterior. Checking out the boot area, looking down on the sill there. Just some light scratches knocking about on the tailgate there but as you can see boot's in excellent condition. You've got your carpet mat there, lift it up so you've got your spare, that's the original plate, all your bits and bobs. Now let's check out the interior. Here's a close up of your door card. Just needs a good valet. But um, looking on this side, you have got some dimples to the, to the door card there. Same issue on the driver's seat. This is where the seat belt's been stuck into it. That's about it. I mean, looking at the, just needs a good clean. Sills in excellent condition. Looking at the back seats, no issue at all there. Looking at the back of the front seats, no issues at all so let's jump inside checking out the drivers got some slight wear into the edge of the balsas there but a good valet should really bring this out really clean checking out the steering wheel and the dash no issues there so we've got a, quite a lot of history with this car everything that is involved with the cars there we've got two sets of keys so we've got two sets of keys Let's start her up, and as you can see here, it starts up really nice. Mileage is at 42,583. Scanning down the central console unit, really clean in here. As you can see, no scratches or anything. Looking down on the glove box, on the dash, no issues at all. If we've got any time, we'll pop the roof back up. So we've got satellite navigation with this car. And um, all you've got some bobs. So we're going to run out of time, but the roof does work. So there you have it, guys, your Continental.